Before this video begins, I just want to make sure that you have a good pair of headphones on so you can enjoy this awesome music. What is up guys, Alex Running Chair back with another video. And in today's video, I'm going to be uncaging my Ultra Boost, meaning that I'm going to be cutting this part of the shoe out of it. And I'm also going to be coloring in this boost right here with Silver Sharpie. And to be honest guys, I'm a little scared of uncaging them and then doing the Silver Boost on it. I'm just going to do it and I'm not going to think about it. I'm just going to get straight into it. However it comes out, it comes out and that's what I'm left with. I hope I enjoy it. But also another thing that I'm going to be doing in this video that I'm also a little worried about because this is not my shoe. Yes, this is not my shoe right here. These Nikes. Somebody at my school actually gave me their shoes and said, I'm really tired of just having this colorway. And he told me, I just want something different. So, I mean, I've seen your videos. I like your Sharpie Customs. So he gave me his shoe and he said, do something, do whatever you want on the shoe. I really don't care. Just do something that's different from just having this plain navy and white Nike shoe. So guys, this is so crazy. Somebody actually gave me their shoe to customize with Sharpies. Sharpies. Not Angela's paint, not all of that paint. Sharpies this this all was a joke like this all started because I wanted to have some fun and I wanted to be different from everybody else and I guess people have just really been liking the videos and somebody actually just gave me this shoe to customize so I'm gonna try to do my best on the shoe all right guys so no more stalling I'm just gonna get straight into the Sharpie custom enjoy the video guys all I'm gonna be using for this custom are some gloves a very sharp knife that are usually used to cut boxes a black sharpie and then also this silver metallic sharpie that I'm going to be using to color in the boost part of the ultra boost, the ultra boost and the Nike. Oh, oh, oh. Shawty, we could get together, it's whatever. Just give me the green light, we swerving down Marine Drive. Windows open and your head blowing. Yeah. I can hardly focus, can you pull? Okay, so I cleaned the ultra boost off camera and then I took the laces off. Now what I'm going to be doing next is with this knife right here that is used to cut like boxes I'm going to be cutting all through right here through this part right here all the way down here so I can take the cage off as you guys can see there's some stitching I don't, know, I don't think you guys can see it but I will be removing the stitching that's connected to this part of the shoe I'm going to be doing that real quick so you guys can see how the ultra boost looks without the cage alright guys enjoy you guys are probably wondering why I'm using gloves because I have bad experience with knives and I really don't want to, I really don't want to get cut again. So yeah, that's what I'm wearing gloves. Okay, there you guys see I removed the stitching from the Prinet and I think I did a pretty good job of it. It was a little dirty because these are not new, they're my beaters. And so far it's turned out great. I really love the pattern that it has on the prime knit. And I just think this custom's gonna look so freaking nice, especially with the laces that I'm gonna be putting on here. You guys see. So make sure you stay watching throughout the whole video. Now I'm slowly gonna be cutting the cage from right here all through over here. And that's gonna make it official and it's gonna be uncaged. All right guys, so I'm gonna get finished with the uncaging part. So the cutting is looking great so far. I think I'm doing a pretty good job of it. But if you get me out, you get a show. There's so many bodies on the floor. So baby, we should go and have some more. Didn't even really want to go. But if you get me out, you get a show. Okay, so there you guys have it. I can't believe I just uncaged my ultra boost and I think I did a pretty awesome job at doing it. Um, I don't think I cut any of the prime knit. I don't think I cut any of the boost. It was just an overall good job. And I'm really pleased with the job that I did. Now I just have to finish the other side. Okay, so there it is. I officially uncaged my Ultra Boost. 
Here are the cages. I think it looks just so crazy and different than with the cages on and I really think I'm going to be enjoying this, especially with the other little things that I'm going to be adding to the boost. So now I'm just going to be uncaging the other shoe, and then we'll be ready to start coloring in that boost silver. So guys, if you are enjoying the video so far and you're enjoying the music, make sure you hit that thumbs up button. I would really appreciate it. It really motivates me. Okay, guys, so put your headphones in and enjoy this music. <clears throat> yeah, 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 yeah. That's yeah. Yeah, yeah. Oh shit, I started cutting the cage down here, but I forgot to remove the stitching from the primate. Shit! Every time I smile, looking like a Koji sweater. Every time I smile, make your girl pussy wetter. Every time I smile, turn the summer to December. Every time I smile, looking like a Koji sweater. Diamonds in my mouth, looking like fruity pebble. Thousand on my outfit, but you know we from the ghetto. Speak a lot of Spanish, yeah, my favorite word, dinero. Kylie Jenner looking bitches, texting me the ghetto. I just hit a Neiman, I just spend a couple thousand. Louis Vuitton on my bitch, even though she from the Nile. Ben and Jerry on my wrist, blue bell around my neck. No. No. Oh my god! No! No! Look what I just did! Oh my god! I swear I fucking hate customs! I just cut my boosts! Oh my god! Oh my- Come on, bruh! Come, I'm so freaking stupid! No, bruh! No! Come on, man! Come on! Look at this big ass hole, bruh! Look at this big ass hole through the freaking flyman shoe! But I think I'm just gonna stitch that up with some some black string and hopefully it stays straight and it's just doesn't look like this! Look at this! Come on, bro! How do I how do Oh my god. Oh shit! Alright, so I freaking finally finished with this uncaging on this. Ultra Boost, man. Look at this hole. Come on, bruh. So I just think, definitely think it's just gonna need some black string stitching right here, and it'll look, it'll look just nice. Just look at that. Come on. How do you do that, bruh? That, I, I don't recommend this shit at all. I, I seriously, I, if I could throw this away right now, I would. But I just don't recommend you buying this. It's just shit. It's shit. Freaking shit. I just have to freaking stop whining. It was an honest mistake. I really didn't mean to do that. I was just going too hard at it. But I'm gonna get my abuelita to sew it, so. Okay guys, so we're almost done with this custom. Now all I'm gonna be doing is silvering out the boost. And for all of you that are gonna get mad because I'm changing the boost color, what I really love about Sharpies is that all I need is a 91% alcohol and I just start rubbing or acetone or whatever and then the sharpie will just go right off so I can remove it whenever I want I just hope the sharpie doesn't crack like once I put it on there a couple days later it, it just fades away I just hope that doesn't happen but I really don't think it's gonna happen because I you know I got the premium sharpies so uh, I'm gonna get right into it hope you guys don't get too mad at me for doing this but you know I wanted to do this custom and I think it's gonna look dope afterwards and these rocks in my mouth hell yeah they cost a check I've been sipping my jibu I've been smoking piccolo I be flexing on these niggas from Japan to Idaho I be acting brand new when I pull up in that bins we just went to school, nigga. We was never friends. Every time I smile, looking like a Koji sweater. Every time I smile, make your girl pussy wetter. Every time I smile, turn the summer to December. Every time I smile, looking like a Koji sweater. Okay, so far it looks super, super freaking dope. Now I'm just gonna let the Sharpie on this shoe dry out and then I'm gonna put a second coat. But while this one dries up, I'm gonna be doing the other shoe and I'm gonna be silvering this one out too. What do you think? Right there. Alright guys, the shoes are finally done right here. It took a couple of days just because I've been busy with other things, but it just took a couple of days and I've got all the little details in. Now all I have to do 
is put the laces on and I'm definitely gonna be so happy about this. I'm gonna be using the laces that came with the Ultra Boost. The Ultra Boost. The Ultra Boost. And I'm going to be doing the NMD Human Race. I'm going to throw up a picture right here so you guys can see how the laces look on the that shoe, the NMD Human Race. And I'm going to be doing the Human Race lacing style on the With the Silver Sharpie, I put in four different holes where the laces are going to be going through. Now, what I'm just going to be doing, just I'm going to be cutting each and every one of them with the knife and then just sticking the laces through it. <laughs> completely done with the Ultra Boost. Now I'm just gonna finish these customs up real quick for the homie that wanted me to change these up and just clean them up. And what I'm gonna be doing to these is just I'm gonna be silvering out this Nike swoosh. And then on the tongue, I'm gonna be, I'm just gonna be coloring this in with the silver Sharpie. And I just think it's gonna look super dope. Just a simple, not too much. Don't wanna mess anything up and just wanna, wanna keep it plain and simple. So I'm just gonna get straight into it. custom i really enjoyed making this video i really want to make some more sharpie customs so guys hit me up if you want me to do sharpie custom on your shoe i already have two shoes lined up ready so make sure you get in line i'm not only going to be dropping sharpie customs but i'm also going to be dropping other things so stay tuned my shout out giveaway is still going on so make sure you go on that video and comment a badass there that is hilarious as hell i've picked two winners so far or three that are really good and two more people can still win so go comment in there so you can secure your spot on there i'm gonna be picking five people thank you guys again for watching comment down below what you thought about the video don't forget to hit that like button and hit that subscribe button down below don't forget to smile do what you love and appreciate what you have it's been ash from age i'm out peace